I made pies. Have you got a toy maker? Look, I found it in the rubbish. Oh, excellent. So what, what are the, what's in these toys? Tomato things. I, could, I can cut one to show you if you like. And this is the patient, by the way. Oh, that's starting with culture. Oh, look at the teeth on it. I know. Isn't that the most... Singularly the most revolting. We'll have to do dentistry as well. Well, I was think? thinking we might have to remove a couple of teeth and we're going to have to remove his larynx. And in doing so, um, the amazing thing about these... Are we uh, these moving the, removing the larynx par anum? Uh, well, well, yes, per butthole. Per butthole. But by doing that, we actually... Um, Remove his parts too. Right now, look, Max. Max, that almost looks gourmet. Would you like to take one home? I just cut it for you. Okay. Or you can take one that's uncut home if you so really want to. Are you talking about circumcised and uncircumcised penises here? No, I'm talking about circumcised and uncircumcised pies. Oh, okay. Pies close to penises. P E in I E S. Yeah, yeah, pies. Right. We are mature women, Meg, with the... What's wrong with this? There is no champagne in your food... Exactly. There's no champagne in Meg's food or racker cycle. Yeah. There this is, is a tragedy. A tragedy. A tragedy. It's all right. There's um, three cases in the car. Okay. We have to anaesthetise this thing. This is what this is for. Oh, okay. Just all you have to Can't do... Can't I just hold his nose like that? Darling, breathe into it. No! <laughs> it smells of fart face. No, 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 breathe into it quickly. No, breathe. Put oh. out. Right, Hang okay. On, let's just see. Yeah, I think he's gone. I think he's gone. He's gone? He's down? Yeah, he's okay. down. Okay. Well, right. Um, Hang on, I'll just, just a little bit more anaesthetic. Okay. And you're going to need to, um, yes, there is a good spot. We're going to have to turn him over because. Okay. So well, he can, he can be on his face. Him at fast face. And I'll turn him this way. Oh, yes, so that I can get it. Okay. Expose the area. Do we need to drape him? No. No, no. I don't think it's so. It's only bumhole surgery. Yeah. Oh. Scissors? You're not very good at that, dear, but I'll cope. Okay, so. I, there's a, a, a string in there that I don't want to um, cut, that one. Okay. Oh. All right. So basically, we need to turn it inside out. It's very tricky surgery, this. I know. It's called marsupialising. Oh, um, he's waking up. He's oh, waking hang on, up. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Hang on. Is he? Oh, he goes. Okay. I hope you can't feel it. I hope so, too. I hope your anaesthetic's good enough. It is. Okay. We might need some serious scissors here. In fact, I might need some pliers because I suspect there's something in here I need to cut. Yes side cutters. Oh dear. Was that you Maggie? No. I fart in C sharp. You fart in C sharp do you? Mm. Oh that was a big good one. I can't find the bit. Why don't I harvest the farts? I know. Ah, there we I'll are. I'll harvest the farts. Okay. And that should keep him. Oh that was a good one. Quick. Anesthetising. Yep there we go. Yeah okay. So you're responsible for keeping the anaesthetic going. Now, yeah. I just have to find out where this goes to. Oh, Maggie. Maggie. Hang on, my fingers are longer than yours. Yes, can you find out where it's going? It's going up to his mouth and his teeth. Oh, so it looks like he's, he's doing that there, but we there need to find it and get it out. Yeah, well, we just pull, don't we, or cut? Well, no, because I want to know where the end is and what's on the end. So I might, we might have to do some surgery in, in here. There's your it? finger. Hang on, I'll stick my finger in his throat. All right. And you can see it from this side. Here you go. There's my finger. So it goes up to where it goes. Yeah. Where does it go up is to? Is he still asleep? Hang on a minute. <laughs> I'll do. <sighs> yeah, there he goes. Okay, where is the end of it? Thing. Hang on a minute. It's lucky you put gloves on. I mean, you're going into his nether regions. Oh, hang on. I'm up to his nose. You're up to his nose. So that's where it's gone. I'm so that's I'm what up that on is. His nose. That's my finger. Yours. Okay. Do we need to take his um, 
Does he need a, a need a nearectomy? Well, a nose job. Yeah, well, we can do that. God, he's worse <sighs> than the bloody Kardashian. Do we want to take any teeth out while we're at it? He's the most awfulest thing, Meg. I know, but won't he be gorgeous once he's just a rainbow? I'm going to make an incision in here, yeah. sister. Excellent. Okay. Oh, right. So it goes to the nose. Yes. Okay. So how's it stuck? Okay, now we've got to take the nose out. We have to take the nose out. We can't possibly ruin the fart machine. It would be easy. All I could do is just chop it off, but I want to keep the fart machine active. Oh, well, then he's just going to have to be cut all around there. I'm going to take his nose out and then I'll um, find another nose for him. There we You're are. He's going to have a nose transplant. Anything will be better than this nose. He's still going. Hang on, I've got to trap another part for... There's a good one. Just put him under a little bit more. There he goes. Yeah, just keeping the cord. Okay. And, and then, it's done. Then we have to remove his nose par anum. Yes. I was always, I mean, I've been threatening to do a tonsillectomy per rectum on someone with a pair of rusty nail scissors um, for a long time. So now I'm a bit better with the anatomy. Look, he's shut up. We've done a laryngectomy. He's That's completely perfect. shut up. Perfect. Oh, slight defect, but it's all right. I mean, I'll just sew it together again. Yeah, no, he's quite cute for the baby. And he really doesn't need liposuction, I don't think. Oh, what's this thing here in his butt? He's got a button. I was thinking that's where it goes to. He's got a button there. I don't know. Maybe that's his butt. Oh, well, let's that's do his, his anus. Button. Why don't you transplant his anus to his nose? We could, we could couldn't we? We mm. could do a butt to nose transplant. Meg, look, we're at the frontiers of science here. Frontiers. Frontiers or the back ears of science. <laughs> <laughs> we're at the arse end of nowhere doing whatever. All right. Do we want to take his tag off while we're at it? Yes. Yeah, I don't like that. tags. He won't notice that, will he? No. There we are. Okay. So, he just needs his button transferred. And I can just sew that stuff, that oh, little I bit know. of... Oh, I just tuck it back in because it's no. Velcroed. Meg, it's yeah, Velcroed. I know, I know, but um, the Velcro is hard. Oh, you just want to be tidy. No, I, I, want to take out some, I want to take out some more. Okay. Because he's... Let's can I do take it. off my um, operating gloves? Yes, we can do um, um, liposuction while we're at it because he's too stiff. And then I can do the nose job as a second thing. A second surgery. Yes. <laughs> the front ears of science. <laughs> the back ears. The back hey, ass of science. Meg. Yes. Look at me. We will go down in the anals of science. <laughs> As frontier busters. <laughs> busters. Busters. You're so funny. Yes. Okay, where was I? Um, we were going to take out this as well. Do you suppose I should just cut it out, like, neatly? Yeah, you we can do that. You can do that. That can be a pro-surgical procedure. Yeah. Minor. But oh. I, I don't understand why. He's got a butt plug. <laughs> Maybe another. Um, <laughs> do we really want to transplant that to there? Or do we want to find a be better one? Oh, I think I've had enough of this now, Meg. Can I retire in my career as a nursing sister? I suppose so. Look, really, do you think you'd be improved oh. by missing a tooth or two? Oh. That is so scary. Hey, get a black Oops. texter. <gasps> get a black texter and black out a couple of these teeth so it looks like a bogan. You're such an artist. Be careful and do it really neatly. I am, if you don't bloody micromanage me. <gasps> and I can't see if you bloody well, anaesthetise him and do it. There you go. Put it in the middle, in the very middle there. Exactly. And he's got a bit of decay on the other two. That's so much more better. -er. And look, he's practically soft now. What do you reckon about that? A little We'll put it back in again. There we are. And then all we have to do is sew him up. Yeah. Prosthesis. Whoop. 
And I was wondering if the pumpkin might do. Won't be. No, that'll just be dingle, dingle dangling. Don't we let could have two of them. Yes. Don't let your dingle dangle dangle in the dirt. Put it in your pocket and it won't get hurt. You had a boy child. <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean, that's, that's Batty. Yep. So we could give him two nostrils. Like a bat. Like a bat. And I also think, think this one looks, these little um, duvalackies that... Oh, they're interesting things. What are these for? They're like for the end oh, yes. of your things. There we are. I mean, that makes perfect sense, doesn't it? It does. The end of your things. I know exactly what you mean. Or that. I think that's a good idea, the black bat. Yes, the they, they look pl pluggy, but yes. Thank he's um, recovering, but um, that was his last part was pretty toxic. Yeah, so, well, let us. Well, I, I'm knitting differently. I'm holding the needle. So, I've been sewing up Farty McFuckface after his laryngectomy per rectum. I'm giving him very neat stitches. And then I'm going to do a nose job on him. Now, I did a rough repair, but I think he'd look better with a pumpkin nose, don't you? Yes. So I'm going to sew that on as well. Now, aren't you vastly improved? Hmm? Vastly.